Okay, you gotta start by taking these out. It's a little clip up under there. You stick something under there. It's a tool for it, but I, again, I don't have those tools because I don't use them all the time. So I just use a screwdriver and stick it up under there. Pop this out and pull the whole thing out. This is why you see most Chevy trucks with one running light, daytime running light, because they get wet and they get full of corrosion in there. And this side was probably still good. I think the bulb might have blown. Yeah, the bulb blown. I'm gonna have to get some bulbs. But it's not full of water like the other one. But anyway, that's why you see that. So I'm gonna run and get some bulbs before I put these lights back in. Hey guys, I'm putting my lights in and I thought I was gonna need another uh, um, harness, but no, this, this goes in where your light switch, I mean where your bulbs were. So you just press them in where your bulbs were and put your backup bulb, backup light. Okay guys, we're gonna rotate some tires. I got them on four jack stands. The front wheel drive vehicle. So we're gonna go from this back side to across on the front. And from, no, I'm sorry. From the back straight up. From that one across to the back. From that one straight up from that one across to here. So the front two crisscross to the back and the back two straight forward. Okay, now is it a good time to check your brakes? Wanna make sure 
Got some pad left. That's pretty good. I knew they were good though.